Grade 3 math, number 97, measure mass. Mass is the amount of matter in an object. We measure mass by weighing. In fact, one of the biggest mistakes people make is they say, how much does that weigh? We shouldn't be saying, how much does it weigh? We should be saying, what is its mass? People have commonly said weigh, so society has been saying weigh. But what we really should be saying is, what is its mass? What is your mass? Instead of how much do you weigh, we should say what is its mass or what is your mass? So, mass is the amount of matter in an object. A gram is a basic metric unit to measure. And a kilogram is also a metric unit to, unit to measure, and they use it all over the world. It's part of the metric system. But in the U.S., we use U.S. standard weights, okay? A penny weighs about two and a half grams, so that'll give you an idea of how much a gram is, okay? One little Lincoln penny is about two and a half grams, not the copper ones, the zinc ones, okay? A box of 400 pennies weighs about one kilogram. So you can see that a kilogram is a lot bigger than a gram, because that's 400 pennies. There's about 30 grams in an ounce, and ounces are what we use here in the United States, okay? So 30 grams is about an ounce. So, we use ounces, pounds, and tons in the U.S. An ounce is the smallest unit of mass one slice of bread is about an ounce. So that means one slice of bread is around 30 grams, right? Because we just read that. Its abbreviation is OZ. So you could see someone write 2OZ means two ounces, okay? A pound is equal to 16 ounces. A bag of flour from the store is usually about five pounds. That'll give you an idea of how heavy a pound is. Five pounds is a sack of baking flour, okay? The abbreviation for pound is LB. Isn't that funny? So five pounds is five LB. A ton is equal to 2,000 pounds. An elephant weighs around seven tons. So if there's 2,000 pounds in a ton, two times seven is 14. That's 14,000 pounds that an elephant weighs. He weighs a lot more than I do. So that is a ton, that is a pound, that is an ounce. Okay? So let me ask you, which has more mass, a strawberry or an apple? Now remember, mass is how much matter is in an object, how much it weighs. So which would have more mass, a strawberry or an apple? Which one would be heavier? The apple. The apple has more mass than the strawberry. Which would have more mass, a dog or a mouse? Which one would be heavier? Even the littlest dog would still be bigger than a mouse, right? So a dog has more mass. Which has more mass, a bowling ball or a tennis ball? Well, I can pick up and throw a tennis ball, but I can't throw a bowling ball. So I would say the bowling ball has more mass. So the heavier item is the item that has more mass. It has more matter in its object, in itself. Remember, the metric system has grams and kilograms, and standard U.S. measurements have ounces, pounds, and tons. I'll see you next video. Keep up your good work.